Uh, in some faiths, uh, Christianity, for example, that uh, uh, a child or a person is born sinful. He is a sinful person. But in Islam, we have the concept of Tawbah. And you mentioned at the beginning that it means return back to. So can we say here that this is a refutation of the fact that a person is born sinful? Because if you're returning back to something, you can't be returning back to something which is sinful. Right. Uh, a person is born sinless. He does not have any sins. And that's uh, religiously is clear in the revelation from Allah. And intellectually also. A born child, why would he born, be born sinful when he didn't do anything? Okay. You know, and that's, it's basic logic that every human being would relate to. You know, and a person is not to be taken with the fault of his father. If a father, you know, committed murder or something like this, and the authorities come and take the son to put the son in prison, uh, people would see that this is a clear injustice. Okay. And this is how can then a son be responsible for sins of others or a human being responsible for the sins of those who are before him. So this is all something that is very clear that it's not from Allah.